Hi, this is Holly, better known as the Fingernail Fixer. Thank you so much for joining me today for this nail tutorial. Let's take a look at how you can get rid of that ridge along the back of your nail when you're doing liquid and powder or in zone three. One of the most important things to consider is gonna be your brush angle. Picking up your bead at the correct mix ratio for the product that you happen to use is important. If you need help with mix ratio, do a search for fingernail fix or mix ratio. I have a tutorial for that. Just pick up a bead and without worrying about actually creating any structure, set the bead down on a nail tip and then look at it while you're pressing your brush along the back edge of the bead and just allow the flags or the very tip of your brush just slightly go past the edge of the back of that bead and when you're pushing it back with just those flags and slightly allowing the tip of your brush to just barely barely go past that back edge you end up transitioning your product into the nail so it's difficult to tell where the nail ends and the product begins which is what you want when that enhancement is growing out you don't want them to be able to snag a nail or anything else on the back edge of your enhancement let's do that again and instead of placing it from the front like you would normally be working let's place it looking at it sideways so that you can look at your brush angle set the bead down and then go ahead and press it as if you were going to be working with it and practice looking at your brush to see that those flags just barely come past the edge of where the product is Notice that that tip of the brush, when you press the product, the product just barely comes to the tip of the brush. It doesn't stay even with the tip of the brush. The tip of the brush is just past the edge of that product. And that's what's going to give you that really smooth transition. It's all about angling the brush up so that you create the shape of the nail and the bulk of your product is gonna be going towards the arch also if you will set your product further away from the back of the nail and use your brush to push that product back towards the edge you'll find that you get a better taper and you're not as likely to run into the skin because we need that teeny tiny margin between the product and the skin to achieve a nail that doesn't lift and you'll find that in angling your brush up and just barely taking the tip of the brush past the product so that it's a smooth transition from the nail into the product you eliminate that little ridge which also can help you eliminate a lot of your lifting i hope this gave you some ideas for how to eliminate that ridge at the back of your liquid and powder enhancements thank you so much for joining me click thumbs up if this was helpful and definitely subscribe take care